1,000 meters. Blazing away from the 1,000 meter marker. Beckoning Beauty and Calvino, the last two. Adina came out strutting her stuff a length and a quarter. Trafalgar Square at the quarters in second, past the 750. Looking Hots in third, and Woodstock Festival's on the outside. The Shadow Roll, two lengths in at Grey Ocean. Calvino, the mere beckoning beauty, drops anchor five lengths off. It's Adina setting a good tempo in front and stretching those legs by two. Trafalgar Square is going to try and aim. Woodstock Festival's under the drive. Grey Ocean on the inside. Adina being kept together at the 300. Trafalgar Square now going to decide to go to the inside. But coming to the 200, Adina showing no signs of stopping. If you back number one, Adina is still well clear. And they're not going to get anywhere near Adina. One by two and a half. Trafalgar Square or Grey Ocean. Maybe Trafalgar Square, then Grey Ocean and Calvino. Wait on the judges for the minor positions. But number one, Adina, like a speeding bullet, never got caught. Number one, Adina. Well done to the golf puller outfit. The Steadmans, Lamascroll Stud. Sipasitle Tlingwa. They had high hose silver. Catch me if you can. And they could not. Trafalgar Square, I thought, second. Let's just have a look there. Put the paper there. Yes, Trafalgar Square, probably second. Grey Ocean, Calvino, Beckoning Beauty, and Woodstock Festival came under the early drive. Quite apparent turning for home that number one, Adina, was just too pacey for the competition. She had them off the bridle, starts to drift towards the outside, and then Sipasitle Tlingwa just allows her to build that momentum and keep going all the way to the winning post. This was bred by the Lammas Grohl Stud for the Steadmans, Mr. and Mrs. Steadman, Garth Puller, the Wiley Hall, and Sipasitle Tlingwa. They'll come home in the first race as the favorite. Back to the studio.